This is a tutorial on a really great text-to-speech web 2.0 tool. It is very, very cool, but there's one thing that you will need to do ahead of time, and that's download Google Chrome. If you have Google Chrome Frame and Internet Explorer, it might work, but in general, Internet Explorer and Firefox do not work for this program. So go ahead and just in Google, type in download Chrome, and you will see Google Chrome Chrome browser, make sure that you are downloading it from google.com and not a third party. And you can download this even if you don't have rights to your machine. Once Google Chrome is installed, you are going to go to, you're going to open it up and go to talktyper.com. And I'll show you just how easy this is. You have to plug in a microphone. Most laptops have built in microphones, so that should work. Um, but if you have background noise at all, you'll probably want a directional mic. And you'll see right here, this is something that I've recorded already. It'll be blank for you if you haven't used it before. Here's a little microphone and you dictate. As soon as you pause in your dictation, it will render your text for you and I will practice. It tells me to speak now, so it's going to record whatever I'm speaking. When I pause, it will stop. Okay. It tells me to speak now, so it's going to record whatever I'm speaking. When I pod, it will stop. Okay, when I pause, so I can edit now and put in my punctuation. Okay, so if I'm happy with this, I just click the down arrow. Then I can talk some more. I can talk and add to whatever I'm doing. When I pause again, it will stop. and I can keep adding to this. Then I can highlight this and copy and paste and put it into Word, which I would probably want to do every once in a while because if I accidentally close this browser, um, it might not be there. A lot of the time if I go back to text typer as you, or talk typer as you just saw, it had what I had from before, but it might not if I clear my cookies. You'll notice also here that here's the copy text to the clipboard, here's sending it right to the printer, here's clearing the text, here's sending an email, tweeting it or translating. I want to tell you that you can also add your punctuation by speaking your punctuation similar to Dragon Dictation. So I'll practice that. If I wanted to go to the bus stop, comma, I should hurry because it is coming soon. Period. Are you going to the bus stop? Question mark. Okay, you'll notice that it did add in my punctuation didn't catch my capital here for some reason and then I would push that down so that's how talk typer works and I hope that help you use some text-to-speak tools